the final say in my story. What does it mean to be a temple for the King? Can His light really shine inside of me? Is there any way for His glory to have the final say? Holy, 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 holy King, alive inside of me, holy. 
in your own words. Just tell him how worthy he is. You're worthy. You're we worthy. love you, Jesus. Jesus. Oh, Just keep lifting you. your voice. I love you, Jesus. Right on.
Hosanna to you the praise. Hosanna, we lift you up. Hosanna to you, worthy, oh, worthy, worthy, holy, holy, worthy, worthy, holy, holy, worthy, worthy, holy, holy, worthy, worthy, holy, Hosanna, Hosanna. This is a year that we are being the temple for the king and that we are experiencing all the power that comes in being his temple. But what happens first is that we say, I establish you as Lord and to be enthroned on my heart. And it comes through my worship. It comes through my choice to say, Jesus, I choose to say that you are the one enthroned and that you are in the highest place in my life and in my heart. And I just see over us that as we're singing this out and proclaiming this, I see other things that have tried to um, maybe take those places just running off and scattering off and breaking off. And I just, I want to stay in this moment because I see the Prince of Peace establishing order in our lives. I see him establishing order in this place of praise. I see him establishing a peaceful, sound mind as we say that, Jesus, I am worshiping you as the, as the great I am in my life and that I enthrone you tonight. And so there's still more, there's still more room for his good rule and good reign in our journeys. But for some, I just feel like tonight is a breakthrough night as you keep leaning into this moment and worshiping him and as you establish him as God on the throne of your heart. I see things falling off that have tried to attach themselves that were not of him and they have no pull and they have no hold because your heart is holy and you are holy. And so I just release right now the Prince of Peace over us as we establish you on the thrones of our heart, Jesus. You are the one true God. 
I want to sing this prophetic song and invite you to sing it with me that there is only one. There's only one that worthy, and his name is the great I am. He is the only one that worthy, and he is the great I am. The world tries to pull you and say, oh, well, this is worthy of praise. Oh, that's worthy of your affection. But tonight, as we sing in worship, we are establishing and saying that there's only one that worthy, and his name is the great I am. So let's just keep lifting up and just even with your imagination, just see right now, just see your life coming into unity coming into full unity with Jesus as you establish him as king. There is only one that worthy and his name is the great I am. There is only one that worthy and he's the great Jesus. 
Always be the center of all I say and do. It's you, you, you. Oh, Jesus, be the center of all I say and do. It's you, you, you. Oh, Jesus, be the center of all I say and do. It's you, you, you. Only 